Welcome to MaxSurf Webinar 4, Video 3 on Tank Calibrations. To carry out tank calibrations, we first need to define the tanks, including their permeability, the geometry of the tank, and the fluid in them. We did that in the previous video. We also need to define the shape of the uh, sounding pipes and also the, any calibration spacing that we want to use along those sounding pipes. Recently we've added the option to carry out tank calibrations at a range of angles. That can be a range of trim angles or a range of heel angles, and so those are required inputs. After the analysis is carried out, the tabular results of the analysis will include a range of soundings, and at each sounding the percentage full, the ullage, the weight, and the centre of gravity of the fluid in the tank at that sounding. Let's switch over to Hydromax and we can see we've got our two tanks defined here with their sounding pipes. We just quickly go over to the sounding pipes window. We can see that the box tank has uh, some user-defined sounding pipes and I've also entered in, entered in a user-defined calibration spacing of 300 millimeters. The mud tank is sent to automatic. If I go to the analysis menu and choose tank calibrations, then I can use the run command to run my tank calibrations as usual. In the results window, we get the results of our calibrations. For each tank, we'll see a range of soundings, and then for each sounding, we'll see a range of results in terms of the ullage, percentage full, capacity, and center of gravity. You can see our spacings are at 300 millimeters. If we scroll down, we'll see the results of the mud tank further down the table. If we want to see the graphical results, we can switch to the graph window, and for each tank in turn, so here the box tank, we can see how capacity changes with percentage full or how the soundings and percentage fulls vary and we can switch from one tank to another. Note also that back in the results table there are some advanced settings. If we go to the display menu and choose data format we can display the free surface area and also the moments of inertia of the fluid in the tank has advanced properties which can be displayed as additional columns. That completes our tank calibrations. Thank you very much for watching.